Jamie, finally clicked today. 4-1 win over Hemel. What would you make on the performance? Yeah, good performance. Happy for the boys. Um, really happy that we've uh, got a result. And it's been tough, you know. It's been tough. It's been it's been painful uh, over the last few weeks to to go through what we're going through in terms of fine margins and not going our way and not quite clicking. And it clicked tonight. Um, played very well, the boys. Still loads to improve on defensively. You know, the, the goal we conceded is, is, is comical. Um, you know, so we'll be we've still got work on stuff like that. Um, but it was a good performance from the boys, and I'm happy for them because they've they've dug in and they've tried tried to uh, get results for the club, and it hasn't quite happened yet. And we had some tough games, you know, Ebbsfleet, haven't full time side, Bath away, you know, Brackley away. It's been a tough start for us. So that was just um, you know a little bit of a, a boost for us and a confidence boost for us to to push us in the right direction. We made a couple of changes today tactically. Do you think it paid off? Massively, yeah. I mean, listen, I, I'm a young manager, right? I'm going to make mistakes. Um, and I'll give me all. You know, I've had sleepless nights for, for three, four weeks. You know, sleepless nights thinking about where am I going wrong? Well, what can I do to improve the team? What can I do to get the best out of them? And you start questioning yourself. You do. When you're losing games, you question yourself. Um, and it's been hard. But at the end of the day, what I've realised at this level... You know, you don't really, you don't focus too much on the other side. Focus on your own team, focus on your strengths, focus on what you have got in a team. And, you know, we've got a lot of good players with pace, with goals, with experienced lads and um, put them on a football pitch and let them play football. You know, how many times have I played as a player and just gone out there and played? And I said that to the boys tonight, just go and play. There's no pressure. Just go and play, enjoy yourselves. We all make mistakes. I'm learning my game. Uh, they're still learning some of them and you know today I've sat there questioning myself over the last few days um, thinking am I getting enough out of them am I getting enough out of them for the club and they showed me tonight that they're willing to fight for me they're willing to fight for the club and they're willing to fight for each other so I'm, I'm proud of them and I'm proud of the performance and, it, and it's a step in the right direction we've got quite a break now until our next game and yeah, nightmare. this win today how much of a boost is it going to be heading towards the next game yeah it's a boost I mean look we, I don't think we've been far off it you know the results say otherwise we've lost games we've lost games but we're not getting beat 4-5 or five, you know we're not getting turned over we're in every single game and it just quite hasn't happened you know individual mistakes over the last four games cost us you know cost us dearly but we, we haven't been out of it um, but tonight was very good it's, it's a nightmare really you know we've had a, a week off because of a team being in the FA Cup so we missed a weekend couldn't get a friendly now we've got another week off uh, the gate, we've got a bye week and then Oxford are in the FA Cup so that's now called off so it's another week without a game which is you know I, I don't understand that I don't get it with the amount of games we've got to fit in in a short period of time we've had two weeks off so it doesn't it's not great for the boys it doesn't help momentum when you want to keep going now you want to keep playing now we've got to try and find the uh, find a team to try and play to keep us ticking over but yeah I mean look it's a positive result for us well done to the lads um, and then we move on to a couple of games where we'll be looking to, to, to kind of kick on as a football club again Brilliant well done today Jamie You're not going to ask me about Drake? <laughs> Got to ask me about Drake At trick today you know <laughs> second all time highest goal scorer how great is he for the club? Phenomenal I was like 114 goals in 129 games 113 today and he made his 150th appearance unbelievable 113 goals at any level is incredible and you know what he's, a, he's been a fantastic servant to the football club not only on the pitch but off it as well and you know, it says a lot about him and he's not played he's been out of the side and you know I went with a one up top um, and you know that wasn't the way to get the best out of him and that's something I've you know I've learnt now and, and you know in having him at the football club you need him in the team right yeah he doesn't doesn't run around as much as he does you know probably three four years ago but my god he can score some goals he's always in the right place at the right time and tonight he put in a massive shift for the team as well so I'm delighted for him you know he's stayed patient he's been frustrated and I've seen that in him but he repaid me today with three fantastic goals for the club cheers Jamie alright